My favorite All-Star moment as a, for me, you got to go with something as a kid because as an adult, we'd rather watch Boston, Toronto, right? We'd rather watch uh, San Antonio, Houston. But as a kid, the All-Star game is this glamorous thing with all your favorite stars. So I'm going throwback 2003, Vince Carter. Uh, he, was, he barely played, but he got voted as a starter in the All-Star game, like that happens pretty often. Um, but it was also Michael Jordan's very last All-Star game, and he's coming off the bench. So he thought he was coming off the bench, and then right before um, the player introductions, uh, they made an announcement, and Vince Carter gave up his spot uh, to MJ. So here's, uh, here's the clip. Oh, I'm excited to see. I, wasn't, I was still in the Philippines when they showed this, so <laughs> I came here in 2005, so 2003 is where well, Vince Carter's era was that. I don't the think I was watching right? basketball then. So yeah, I, so I wasn't really. watching really much basketball. So MJ was apparently pretty upset by this. Uh, and then now Vince comes out, he gets the nod. I love the early 2000s bagginess of the clothes. <laughs> he made it big. I think Vince Carter made that baggy guy, short yeah, big. Exactly. Like. But then yeah, Vince Carter went on to have nine points. So you ever, this game is fully on YouTube. Ooh. The full game is on YouTube, no commercials. It's Ooh. the last OT game to Brad go into Miller, overtime. So like, I forgot what Brad, Brad Miller, Miller was. Brad Miller, Yao Ming, Shaq, Kobe, Ooh. MJ. Like this game, Allen Iverson. This game is awesome. Oh it went into double God. overtime. It's the last what? overtime game uh, Man, where, for an all-star game. Where was game. this? Where was it? I believe this one was Houston, actually. You, oh, that's where Yao Ming was. Yao like, Ming was a starter. Oh, man. Um, These were our players T-Mac was in too. It. So the, in, the end of overtime, again, this is all on YouTube. You can check this out. At the end of overtime, MJ hit a, hit a bucket to go up uh, with four seconds left. And then Kobe came down and got fouled on the three, tied the game, sent a double OT. Uh, Kevin Garnett won MVP Oof. with 37 points. Oof. Man, some throwback players right there. Yeah, so that, that that's probably my favorite All Star game because this is me, 11 years old. Uh-huh. That's when All Star. Yeah. That's when you know. That's like, prime. And those, and those were All-Star. those were when the jerseys were pretty simple. Not yeah, not like, exactly. Yeah. I remember 2014. Was it 2014? Oh, we're gonna see something good. T shirt. We're gonna see something. Oh, Woo. he almost did the elbow dunk. He almost. Man, I thought I was gonna do the elbow dunk. Back then was just <laughs> yeah. not even. That was a year before he actually uh, tore our hearts out as Raptors fans yeah. stomped on the yeah. ground and then. Cock and alley oop to dunks <laughs> and playoff heartbreak. And, oh my god! You know yeah. that whole that whole scene. <laughs> I'm, but I'm pretty excited for this year's All Star game because it's same. Like, I mean, it's it's in the well, New Orleans. New Orleans hosts very well like uh, All Star games. And the plus, last one was really. The good. one thing I'm really um, like besides dunk contests and all that stuff, right? I'm really I'm really con- I'm considering about how. Uh, Russell Westbrook and Kevin Durant are going to play together. That storyline is... The is last, that, that going to be the biggest thing right now that everyone's looking around? I, yeah, I think it's that one. The other one is uh, LeBron James is tied for most field goals made in an All-Star game. So after that field and goal right now, he's second in, I think, All-Star MVPs. So I think he's going to put he's on a bit of a put performance. I, I, think, I think besides Kevin Durant and Russell Westbrook like butting heads, I think Russell Westbrook wants to get back-to-back MVPs. One yeah, day. exactly. He's and a that's competitor. Pretty good. I think he wants to show Durant that he he's much as good or much better than yeah. really Durant was because that's was well you know. all the all of the the kind of alumni players that are on TV always talk about how Westbrook has that like competitiveness that yeah. you kind of see every coach in all those was saying players, that right? he's exactly. the kind of player that you want to coach like, and, and when you watch those old 80s all-stars games which have a bunch have been on TV lately they've been watching they're going hard from the minute yeah. coach calling oh, yeah. timeouts they're calling they're uh, complaining about fouls Westbrook is gonna play hard I think so it's, he's that old school type of player exactly. when we yeah. watched like back then like you mentioned they're actually playing to win and they're competing yeah but now it's more like just showcase in a sense yeah right? it's yeah. very much a showcase yeah. i'm gonna take a deep three well yeah. before it was alley-oops that yeah. was the thing and then now it's all deep a threes, threes. Yeah. yeah like <laughs> that Dion waiters tim hardaway kind of match yeah. Yeah. Don't, Dion don't, waiters. Yeah. Don't, even bo- don't even don't even bother like throwing down the pass just like yeah. dunk it and we'll let defense yeah. won't matter until the fourth quarter exactly, exactly. Yeah. but you know, as as long as it's close in fourth quarter, uh, everybody's in for a show. Exactly. And I'm excited. Well, I'm excited. Exactly. Uh, what I want to hear from you guys is since we're all going to be watching, tune in this weekend. What's your uh, what's your all star prediction this coming weekend? Let's start with I guess the rising star. Who do you think is going to take the um, Oof. the MVP for the rising star? So you got the world against. USA. I don't really follow the rookies and sophomores this this season. I, I I'm, but I'm I, I go for US yeah. off the bat. So US is gonna I'm, win? Gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and stick with my Canadian boys and yeah. I'm gonna, so go, gonna for go for world, right? And I'm gonna say Jamal Murray wins uh, MVP, MVP of that game. Who do you got winning MVP for the US? Oh, Jamal Murray. Oh, I think oh Joel Embiid's not playing. 
He uh, got injured, so you got Jokic just replacing him right right now. So. Oh, yeah. World, world team has a really good squad. World team's got a good squad. They got a yeah. good squad. So they, they who do you have? Who do you have winning? Him? You got. I, I think Cat can win it if um, if US this can uh, it wins against the world. We got. I'll, I'll take Cat because I want to yeah. go straight to I, yeah, the, okay. the three we'll point Kat, shootout. Yeah, who do you guys think shootout. winning the three point shootout? I'm you gonna guys? say last year was Clay, right? Yeah. And the year before was Steph. Steph. I'm gonna say Steph takes it back this year. Yeah, he's not competing actually. Oh, he's not. He's not. He decided he's not. not to. So oh, you have I Clay. Say, you I, have say, Brad, I say Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving. Yeah, uh, Lowry's in. Lowry's in. I don't Nick want Young, to do two, <laughs> But Kyle Lowry, yeah, yeah, like you know. can't. Uh, Lowry's a game time three point yeah, shooter. He's a game for me. time. Uh, he's yeah. a he's a step in. He doesn't. He's not a standalone yeah. shooter. He's no. not, he can't. If do he's that. allowed to go right to left and elbow three all of them. Like mm, great, yeah. he'll win. But if, if he can run into a shot in transition, then he'll definitely win. Okay, I'm gonna go Clay again for back to back. I go with Kyrie. Kyrie. He's had to take a step back this year, so you know. I see that. This no, I can chance. see that. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with my boy uh, Wesley Matthews, the dark horse. So I'm Wesley? gonna go with him. Yeah, so he's yeah. a dark horse. He's a standalone shooter. So I can see where yeah, that goes. I think. Going. I think my. Oh, well, my, I have a sleeper. I think Nick yeah. Young. Nick, Nick Young, Young is just, swaggy. He might. He likes he the spotlight. Have, he loves so the I can spotlight. see that. Yeah. If he wins, we'll have to hear about this for the next five years. <laughs> and he's just gonna be posting about <laughs> He'll it. He'll have right? T-shirts made. Everything. Oh, free point he's chance. gonna pull J.R. Smith. But what do we have for the dunk contest? Who do you guys have as um? Everyone's favorite. If, I know it's Aaron Gordon. So who do you guys? Aaron think? Gordon's gonna compete. I I'd go with him. If not, then I'd go with uh, Derek Jones Jr. I've seen his tapes. His no, tapes, he's only played like a couple minutes. His warm up videos are incredible. Yeah. But for me, for longing for the days when the players, the good players, were in the uh, the dunk slam dunk contest, contest yeah. like Kobe's won one. You know, Vince Carter was a top player. MJ, Dom, they all like it was part of a thing to do. But so I'm gonna go Aaron Gordon because last year I was I was at the Saturday Night All Star game. Or all star skills, and he it was incredible to watch the things he, he did. Just, oh so I'm gonna God. I'm gonna go Aaron Gordon uh, wins it this year. Yeah, it's, it's I a, think you're all rooting for him I, because I he deserved yeah. to he deserved win last, last year. year. It's he just deserved. it's just yeah he got he got snubbed he got robbed. Um, but it's just it's definitely hard to compete from what he did last year. Yeah. Like, those were some really, some really, really good yeah, dunks. Him and Zach Levine put on, was it, I want to say like four or five dunks that have never been seen before. And 50, <laughs> 50s back to back? Yeah, All like 50s. It, was in, it was insane. It was surreal. Yeah. I, I, it was surreal to watch. I agree, I agree. What's your, what's your pick? I, I'm going to, I was rooting for him as well. Yeah. Like my, oh, Aaron I just, just because he deserved to win, right? Yeah. So to cap it off, who do you guys think is going to win? The All-Star, East West? West. And who's going to be your MVP? West, Russell Westbrook. West, Russell Westbrook. I'm going to go East, uh, LeBron James. All right, I'm going to go West. And I'm going to go with my boy Kevin Durant. I think Durant's oh going to... He, he's going to prove something to, to Westbrook. I think and I if they lose, he can just go play for the East next year. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs>